we get to tour this 1,765 square foot home. It sits on a lot size of 8712 and it was built in 2018. Let's go in and take a look. All right, let's go in and take a look at this beautiful home. Located right in the foothills of wonderful Palm Springs Mountains. An inviting door. Very sleek and modern designs. As you come in, you can't help but notice the beautiful vaulted ceilings up top, high ceilings, modern lines, wonderful big tile floors throughout this home. And we are in the great room of sorts. Very open floor plan. Look how that opens up into the eating area and the kitchen. by that door to the left, but for now, let's explore this wonderful living and kitchen area. As I said, very high ceilings, and you can see that wonderful ceiling fan that keeps everything nice and cool. Central air in here as well. dining room as well. Again with another fan and light. Very private backyard that we'll go out and take a look at in a minute. And it also is light and bright. Very breezy day today as you see outside. So we have a wonderful, very large size sink in the island with a big gooseneck faucet. I don't know if you can see that light as well. Kind of wonderful. High-end stainless steel appliances. That's a KitchenAid. It's a nice size gas cooktop. And let's just take a look. There we go. Get an idea of the size. Beautiful cabinets. Yeah, let's just take a look at the drawers as well. Oh, they are self-closing. That's what I wanted to see. Let's see. And there we go. Perfect. It 
It has little points of interest as far as little windows in the kitchen. <clears throat> With that quartz backsplash continuing up from the countertop. KitchenAid microwave as well. And matching dishwasher. Very nice and quiet, that one. It's very well insulated. And the KitchenAid fridge, as well as the freezer. Well stocked for this summer day. So as we're going straight ahead, we get to look at this nice oversized laundry room equipped with a built-in sink, undermount sink, as well as cabinets down below and up above for all your storage needs. It does have a washer and dryer and that large tile is continued in the laundry room as we go straight ahead into the garage. But first, let's take a quick look on our right. And we see there's a nice size this way, there we go. A nice size pantry in here. Looks like it's well utilized and has room for all your needs. <clears throat> so let's run on into the garage. As you see, it has a lovely alarm system and a nest system as well to be able to program the temperature and all of your neat high-tech features from far away from a remote area. I'm actually trying to find the light right now as you're wondering what I'm doing but let me give you at least an idea here. I'm not having very much success turning that light on. Let me see again. Hey there we go. And this is a wonderful three-car garage, and guess what? You don't see very many three-car garages. Oh, and they have a little utility sink here, which is nice. All right, let's head on back through the laundry room and back into the kitchen area. Again, looking at that dining room. And how about we go over here by the front door to take a look at the first two bedrooms and the bathroom. As I'm coming into this little alcove area where the beds are, you see this very nice size cabinet area. And there's that nest that I was talking about. Always great. So this first bedroom, as you can see, is carpeted. And what a beautiful view of the famous Palm Springs Mountains. Very high ceiling in here. So wonderful ceiling fan is here as well as the light. get an idea and the closet is to the left it's a nice size closet that goes back pretty far I would say it's probably an eight foot closet and it has a shelf and rod as well the closet is mirrored on the outside to make this already well appointed size bedroom appear even larger Let's take a look at it from this angle. And there's your view. That's kind of great. Looking at your backyard, at your pool. And there's the mountain. All 
right. As we leave that first bedroom, we're going to take an immediate left and take a look at this second bedroom. There is a bathroom right here, a shared bathroom, and we'll check that out in a second as soon as we take a look at this bedroom. Looks like they're using this bedroom as an office. Again, it's a very nice size bedroom. <clears throat> Equipped as well with a ceiling fan and light it matches the other one. Nice and private. And it also has that mirrored closet with the shelf and rod. And again, it goes back. I'd say this one is probably a good six feet, six to eight, something like that as well. Let's take a look at it from another perspective. And as we leave this bedroom, we're going to take that immediate right and take a look at that shared bathroom. Very nice size bathroom. It has that beautiful thick glass shower. Beautiful rectangular tile in a nice neutral tone. High ceilings as well. Toilet and vanity. Nice size with lots of storage. Undermount sink with that. Take a quick right and take a look at that wonderful ensuite. Look at that covered patio. We'll get to go enjoy that in a second. Here we go. Bedroom number three is also carpeted. Well appointed, separate from the other two, and very private. Nice high ceilings. Big window making it light and bright. Looking out onto your own wonderful backyard. <laughs> Another perspective here. So let's go check out that on shall we? <clears throat> Going into the bathroom, you're struck with that wonderful, wonderful size shower. It's a double shower, has two shower heads, <clears throat> has a niche for all of your toiletries, and towel bars at each end. One here, as well as all the way on the other side. This is a really, really nice size shower. As you can also see, it has that wonderful thick glass as a partition that goes straight down the center but doesn't block your view at all or make your bathroom seem smaller. They've really expanded it, which is nice. <clears throat> and let's take a look. At the vanity. It is a dual undermount sink as well, dual vanity. Lots of storage space. 
It has that raised cabinet, which is very easy to clean. And as we go over to the first door, it has a separate private water closet, which is wonderful. And that flooring is continued throughout. Nice high ceiling. Exhaust fan. There's the light fixtures. And let's just take a quick look into the closet as we go straight ahead. big mirrored closet that is quite deep and has the entire closet package here with shelf and rod throughout. And this is very nice as well as far as storage, you betcha. All right. Taking a walk as I'm coming out of the closet there. There we go. Into, back into the bedroom area of the master. And going straight ahead out into the living area again. Shall we take a look outside? Let's do that. Great big, wonderful patio slider. And they've got your patio all set up, covered patio, ready to start enjoying this warm summer day. Of course, no covered patio would be complete without that wonderful fan for circulation. And as we head to the left, you can see a hammock. All ready to swing your cares away from the day. Nice and private backyard. There's the side look of the side yard. And pea gravel on the side, as well as a small patch of grass. That leads out onto your pool and hot tub. This will keep you nice and cool. This side is your hot tub and hot tub. This side has a little bit of a platform for sun tanning, equipped with an umbrella that's built right into the pool, which is And there it is. This nice dipping pool is going to keep you nice and cool on these hot days. More of a yard back here with some grass along with a very private backyard. Sitting area. Let me pop back here and give you a better perspective from the very back of there we go. And they have new construction around it. That project that you see right there are single family homes on zero lot lines. Upper end, very modern, it's called the Icon. Desirable area of Palm Springs. Close to everything, yet privacy awaits you here at this home. This home would make a wonderful investment property and wonderful for a short term rental.
All right, guys, that is going to wrap up our tour. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, all our contact information are in the links down below. Feel free to give us a call or an email. Until next time, guys, see you next time. Bye-bye.